<laughs> no. All right, guys. So this is my favorite go-to uh, low body movement sequency. Three easy moves that I teach pretty much everyone that I work with. Um, so depending on the level of comfort or discomfort that you have in your low back, you're going to start either seated or lying down. Okay, so let's say your back is really hurting. You're like, oh man, it hurts to sit up. Lie down. You're gonna have your feet slightly hip width apart. You're gonna take your knees over to the right side and get the whole leg of the front leg that's closer to the floor. That one lays down on the floor. On the top leg, you're reaching towards the floor. Your chest is nice and open. Then you bring your knees up and the same thing goes to the other side. You start with the front leg first. That drops down to the floor. Then the top leg reaches down towards the floor okay so that's the movement all right so now you're going to time it with your breath you inhale on the way up and you exhale over to the side you inhale all the way up knees up towards the ceiling of the sky then the legs back to center so you're going to do this at a nice cadence at a nice rhythm probably for about 30 seconds all right so see it's just back and forth so I call this uh, windshield wipers or 9090s is what it's called also. Uh, the next stage of it would be with you sitting up, okay? Sitting up again, knees hip width apart. And again, notice how I bring one knee down, the other leg follows. And you just go back and forth and you're swishing. And you're swishing. And you're connecting with your breath, okay? From here, it is super easy to go straight up into world's greatest stretch. You take the knee forward. You take the knee forward, opposite leg, opposite arm. And you take one elbow down towards the floor, so don't let you can. The back knee is on the floor. You can have the toes pointing back or toes curled under. But you have the arm coming down same arm has the knee that's bent coming down towards the floor and then you inhale and you open up now the main thing that I tell my clients with this is that you want to think of your torso like a cylinder and that it turns right so you're turning that cylinder all right make sure you switch sides again the knee Maybe you can go in front of the toe. That's okay. Get yourself into a nice lunge. Same arm, same leg. Goes down to the floor. And you inhale up. And you can really see the rotation of the torso here. And you're feeling this movement towards the low back, middle back, upper back. So again, you do that for about 30 seconds. Okay. And then the last move that I really like to have all of my clients do is go from world's greatest stretch over to this movement for the knees um excuse me that you're on your knees for your hips okay so you have one knee down one knee in front okay and you go straight forward and straight back straight forward and straight back then you take the same front knee and you move it out to 45 degrees and you go in a diagonal, forward and back, forward and back, and then you go all the way 90. Make sure that your hips, your shoulders are squared, and you go to the side so you feel more of a inner groin stretch. Okay, so you can do about 30 seconds on each side. Again, switching sides. <laughs> I got all muddy. Okay, switching sides, forward, and back forward I'm gonna show this side view so you can see how I am moving from my pelvis forward pelvis back pelvis forward pelvis back and taking the knee out to 45 degrees to the side so it's more of a diagonal and you're feeling it into your groin or groins and then over to the side 90 degrees you want to line up your heel to your knee and then you're able to go to the side so these movements get to 
the whole cylinder of the hip, right? The side, the front, the inside of it, the back of it. We can get more into if we wanted to maybe bring our knees into the chest, but that's another thing we can talk about. So those are three easy moves that I suggest all my clients do when they come in and they're um, stiff, stuck, just really congested around the low body pelvis area. And I hope these help you. If you'd like to book a session with Nayeli Cardenas at Align Body Work and Yoga, go ahead and send me a DM and I look forward to meeting you. Thank you.